This system configuration is coupled with a previously selected test program. When loading the test program, all saved settings are automatically loaded, allowing the operator to get started immediately. Once the test program is loaded, you can drive the machine to the start position of the saved system configuration. All relevant testing system and safety settings, such as crosshead position, tool separation, and sensor configuration are defined once and saved in a system configuration in Test Expert 3. Even for machines with two test areas and multiple connected sensors, the respective system configuration knows which settings and sensors must be used. An image can also be stored for each system configuration. These images provide the operator greater assurance since the respective image shows the corresponding system configuration. Changes to the system configuration are protected by a key switch on the electronics and can only be performed by authorized personnel. With the corresponding authorization, you can set the limits for a load cell within a test, for example. There is also force monitoring outside of the test that stops the testing machine once even a slight increase in force is detected, which guarantees maximum user and machine safety. An additional load cell in the second test area is also monitored within its applicable limits. When changing the test program, you can confidently set the machine back to the initial position defined for that test type. The associated system configuration is loaded automatically and takes over all settings and monitoring activities. If you use interchangeable specimen grips or tools in your machine, you only have to create a corresponding system configuration once. Test Expert 3 will take care of the rest for you. Each of the tests for this test program begins at the exact same start position and reproducible test results are guaranteed. Here you can also see your test arrangement and the associated sensor technology at a glance. Without activating the key switch, you can view the settings, however, you cannot change them. The person responsible for the lab approved the setting via key switch and you can now adjust the load cell settings. In this case, restrict the force limit to 800 N, provided that you do not want to load your test arrangement with a force that is any higher. Afterward, save all the settings that you configured and the key switch then protects them from any unauthorized changes.